আমরা ভেক্টরের তৃতীয় পর্ব আলোচনা করব মানে আমরা এর আগে দুটো পর্ব করেছিলাম অনলি প্রবলেম সলিউশন বিভিন্ন ডিফাইন্ড কম্পিটিটিভ কম্পিটিটিভ एग्जामের জন্য এই কম্পিটিটিভ एग्जामের লাস্ট পর্ব আমি এটা এই পর্যন্ত আমরা লাস্ট পর্ব করছি এটা হচ্ছে থার্ড পার্ট এখানে কিছু বেশি প্রবলেম আমি তুলে নিই বেসিক্যালি চারটি প্রবলেম তুলেছি খুব ইজি প্রবলেম সেই প্রবলেমগুলো ডিসকাস করছি যেগুলো বিভিন্ন পরীক্ষা এসে তো ফার্স্ট প্রবলেম ইজ দ্যাট ইফ মড এ ইকুয়ালস টু 3 এন্ড মড বি ইকুয়ালস টু 5 এন্ড মড সি ইকুয়ালস টু 7 এন্ড এ প্লাস বি প্লাস সি ইকুয়ালস টু 0 দেন ফাইন্ড দ্য অ্যাঙ্গেল বিটুইন এ এন্ড বি এটা জিলেট 2009 এ এসে 2009 এ এসে যে আমাকে এ বি এর মধ্যে অ্যাঙ্গেল বার করতে হবে তো মোস্ট অফ the question is that how to find the angle between the two vectors if a and b is given to you this is a and this is b and if the angle between them is theta so a dot b by definition of dot product is mod a mod b co cosine theta so cosine theta equals to a dot b by mod a and mod b and theta equals to this cos inverse this and from this relation you will get the value of theta মানে এখান থেকে তুমি থিটার মানটা পেয়ে যাবে তো এই এক্সপ্রেশন থেকে আমার প্রথম গোল হচ্ছে হাউ টু ক্যালকুলেট এ ডট বি যদি এ ডট বি টা পেয়ে যায় কারণ মড এ মড বি অলরেডি ইজ गिवन टू यू দেওয়া আছে তো এ ডট বি টা বার করাটা আমার চ্যালেঞ্জ ওকে তো হোয়াট ইজ মাই রিলেশন দা রিলেশন ইজ गिवन टू यू এ ভেক্টর প্লাস বি ভেক্টর plus c equals to 0 vector so if we take c vector to right hand side we will get minus c vector and now a plus b whole square you can write down minus c whole square you can write okay so or taking more product so this is a plus b dot a plus b ओके आई रेज दिस पार्ट आई कैन राइट डाउन हेयर आल्सो ए प्लस बी डॉट सी इक्वल्स टू माइनस सी डॉट सी टेकिंग डॉट प्रोडक्ट सी बोथ साइड सो व्हाट इज सी ए प्लस बी आई कैन पुट हेयर सी इक्वल्स टू माइनस ऑफ ए प्लस बी बोथ सी इक्वल्स टू minus of a plus b you can put down here also so minus of a plus b vector and this is minus mod of c square so you will get minus a plus b dot a plus b you take minus outside the dot so and this minus minus cancel you will get so a dot a a dot b b dot a and b dot b just simply multiplication by using dot product okay mod of c square and from this we can write down here mod of a square and since a b and b a both are same because dot product is commutative you can write down 2 into a dot b because you put down b dot a equals to a dot b and this is mod of b square that's equals to mod of c square what is the value of mod of a square mod of a square equals to 9 that is 3 square 2 into a dot b and mod b equals to 5 square and mod c equals to 7 that is 7 square so 2 into a dot b equals to 49 minus 25 minus 9 that is what is the value 35 that is 15. Am I right or wrong? 9 and 49 minus 34, 15. So A dot B equals to, you will get 15 by 2. So what is the angle between them? So cos cosine theta I have read A, A dot B equals to mod A and mod B. So cosine theta equals to a dot b by mod a and mod b. So I have gotten 15 by 2 that is a dot b and mod a equals to 3 into 5. 
so you will get half and half that is cos 60 degree or cos pi by 3 so theta equals to pi by 3 so angle between the vectors is pi by 3 okay so that i have to determine it okay then the angle between a and b so the option is c okay so i have solved this problem so due to lack of space i have written here also cos theta equals to a dot b by mod a mod b and 15 by 2 and mod a equals to 3 mod b equals to 5 so you will get half half equals to cos 60 degree or cos pi by 3 and theta equals to pi by 3 that is the angle between the two vectors a and b okay i have solved the first problem second problem that the points with the position vectors is 60 i plus 3 j and 40 i minus 8 j cap and a i cap minus 52 j cap are collinear what is the meaning of collinear three points are given to you their collinear means they are lies in the same line okay so there are three point a b c if you calculate a b or b c either a b and b c coincide or they are parallel to each other that is the condition of the collinearity so our point of the position vector of a equals to say let 60 i cap plus 3 j cap b is 40 i cap minus 8 j cap and c equals to a i cap minus 52 j cap okay so now the position vector the a b vector equals to position vector of b minus position vector of a that's equals to uh, 6 b minus a that is minus 8 minus 3 that is minus 11 j cap and b c equals to position vector of c minus position vector of b that is a minus 40 into i cap minus 52 minus plus 8 that is 42 j cap okay so according to the condition a b is so a b and b c are collinear means a b is parallel to b c or they are coincide and you can write down a b vector some constant into b c vector so what is a b that is minus 20 i cap minus 11 j cap equals to a m into a minus 40 i cap a minus 40 into i cap plus 44 into m into j cap and multiply throughout the vector. Okay, so since both are equal, so this part and this part is equal, this part and this part is equal. So 44m into equals to minus 11, you will get m equals to 1 by minus 1 by 4. And the second part is minus 20 this part equals to the coefficient of i cap equals to coefficient of this i cap both are equal so that's equals to minus a into a minus minus 20 equals to a into a minus 40 you have already got in the result a equals to minus 1 by 4 put to a equals to minus 1 by 4 a minus 40 equals to minus 20 you will get a minus 40 equals to 8 this is minus and minus plus okay all right uh, 20 and that is i am wrong i am wrong yeah this is uh, minus and this is minus also okay so m equals to 1 by 4 minus 44 m minus 11 so this is equals to m equals to 1 by 4 and you put down a equals to 4 that is minus 80 and then you will get a equals to minus 4 t this is the value so the answer is that option is a equals to minus 40 okay okay next problem number three i have discussed here problem number three the vector this is perpendicular to this okay problem number three is perpendicular to this uh, that means two vectors are perpendicular to each other if their dot product is zero Okay. So, this question is appeared in 2008. So, 2i cap plus j cap minus k cap, they are perpendicular this vector and this vector i minus 4, 4j plus lambda k, they are perpendicular to each other means their dot product is 0. So, you calculate 2 into 1 plus 1 into minus 4 minus 1 into lambda equals to 0. So, 2 minus 4 minus lambda equals to 0, you will get 
lambda equals to minus 2 that is the answer for, for what values of lambda the vectors are perpendicular that is for lambda equals to minus 2 the vectors are perpendicular so the option is c okay this question is also appeared in 2008 problem number four that is we have to calculate a force a is given to you and applied at the point this if its moment about the point B, okay, so force is applied and at the point is given to you, uh, say A, 1, 2, 5, and we have to find out the moment about the point B, say, minus 1, minus 2, minus 3. So moment is a vector also, okay. So I can calculate B A vector, that is R vector equal that is B A, that means position vector of A minus position vector of B. Okay, position vector of A minus position vector of B. Okay, so 1 plus 1, that is 2 I cap, 2 plus 2, that is 4 J cap, 5 plus 3, that is 8 K cap. Okay, so now there is a R vector. So what is the moment? Moment is that R cross A. That is the moment. Okay, according to physics, according to the physics, the force moment is also another vector. So I have gotten R cross A, and that is also given to you 60 I cap minus 6 J cap plus 2 lambda K cap, and I have to determine the value of lambda. Okay, so now I have to calculate R cross A. What is my R? R I have gotten. What is my f? f is given to you already in your question 2i cap minus lambda j cap plus 5k cap. So now I have calculated R cross A that is i j k and coefficient of i j k that is 2, 4, 8 and f is 2 minus lambda 5. And ne next I have to calculate 20 plus 8 lambda and minus j into 10 minus 16 plus k cap into minus 2 lambda minus 8. Okay, so 20 plus if I simplify it, 20 plus 8 lambda into i cap and minus 4, 6 plus 6 into j cap minus 8 plus 2 lambda into k cap. Okay, according to the question, the Force, the moment is given to you. This is the moment you result. So this equals to 16i cap and minus 6j cap and plus 2 lambda k cap. Okay. So minus j 10 10 minus 16 i cap j cap. I have wrongly written maybe. The position vector of B minus position vector of A, 2i cap minus lambda cap, that is 5 cap, and B is the point minus 1 minus 2, so 3, this is B. I have now written position vector of B. Look at the position vector of A and position vector of B, that is minus 1 minus 1, A, 1 plus 1, 2, 2 plus 2, 4. 5 minus 3 that is 2 plus 2k and if you write down 2 okay so we will get i cap into 20 plus 2 lambda okay 2 lambda and minus j into 10 minus 4 that is minus 6 i have wrongly done here because i have put this is minus 1, minus 2, 3. I have written here minus 3. So, I erase minus sign here. So, position vector of A minus position vector of B, I have calculated. That is 2i cap plus 4j cap, k cap plus 2k cap. And then after the calculation, k cap equals to minus 2 lambda plus 8. And then that is correct. So, both are same. So, you will get this part equals to e plus 20 lambda equals to 16. So, you will get lambda equals to. 2 lambda equals to minus 4 and lambda equals to minus 2. 
and from last expression is it consistent or not you have to check this also equals to minus 8 plus 2 lambda equals to that is 2 lambda and you will get 4 lambda equals to minus 8 and lambda equals to minus 2. So the option is that 4 equals to the option is C. Okay. So this question is also appeared in 2011. So what is the moment? Moment means R cross A. And J point take apply to G, apply to G point it take J bindu take moment in a way. Second take a shape point a B A part of the not A B B A position vector of A minus position vector of B. Okay. Thank you.